Is he aware that at a ZANU-PF rally on February 26, Vice President Chiwenga said of the Opposition Citizens' Coalition for Change, you see how we crush lice. You make it on a flat stone and then flatten it to the extent that even flies will not make a meal of it. That is what we are going to do to the CCC. The following day, a CCC rally was attacked with iron bars, machetes and spears. One opposition supporter was killed and many more hospitalised. Will the government condemn the Vice President's violent incitement and work with the international community to hold the Zimbabwean government accountable for the safety and security of all Zimbabweans who should have the right to freely elect their leaders without fear of violence or intimidation? Yeah. My Lord, I'd like to thank the noble Lord, and I agree that such language inciting political violence has no place in any country, including Zimbabwe. We urge the government of Zimbabwe to live up to their constitution in ensuring that all political parties are allowed to operate and campaign without harassment. As our ambassador publicly stated after the death of the CCC supporter at the rally of the 27th of February, we urge the police to fully investigate any acts of political violence and bring, bring the perpetrators to justice.